What's going on everyone? Welcome back into another reverse 1999 video. Today we are on day 52 of the free to play journey. Um, I just wanted to clear something up. Yesterday when I was talking about uh, Satsuki, I was I was meaning that she combos well uh, with Druvis, not, not Jessica. I was uh, mistaken myself by accident for uh, Kanjira, Kanjira uh, to go with uh, Jessica if we didn't have our Sotheby. So I apologize on that. I kept on saying Satsuki with uh, Jessica. I meant to say with Druvis, which is why I wanted to build her up because we already have the Druvis built up already. So with that out of the way, um, on this one, I just wanted to kind of go over what my path is for the next couple of days. Obviously, there's not going to be like a huge increase on the account or anything like that. Uh, currently, we are on stage four of Limbo. I am going to try my hardest tonight to get through as much as I can on Limbo. I would assume that we can get to five again and knock that out and just have six left over. We'll see how six kind of treats us uh, with this refresh if we have like the proper people and everything in place to go in there. Um, but I'm assuming we'll at least get five before that little refresh of the rewards. Uh, as for the event, uh, we went ahead and cleared everything out. I think I showed you guys yesterday, but we went ahead and cleared everything out and we started uh, farming on the 13. Um, I did realize whenever I was talking yesterday, someone let me know that on hard mode, everything is free. Um, and so 13 is what we want to be farming. So I did use all the resources on 13 today to get as many red soils as I could. Uh, we bought a golden fleece and we bought out the uh, long night talk. So we got that one and the unilogs are built, uh, bought out as well. We're gonna start working our way through the uh, rest of these right here. And uh, I will 100% grab Gluttony, but it's not gonna do us any benefit because we are gonna be saving it for GU's Psy Cube anyways. So it's not gonna be directly impacting what we're going for at the moment. At the moment, what we are gonna be doing uh, in the account right now, as you can see, I did level up these three a little bit more just to get them even. I hate odd numbers whenever I look at them on the account or like, you know, not, you know, even numbers like this, 20, 40, 10, stuff like that. Uh, so I did get them up a little bit more, which obviously it gives them stats in return. Um, what I am thinking now is uh, we're going to knock out Melania for sure next and foremost. But my next thing is I think I'm going to keep both of them at uh, 50 I2. I don't think I'm going to progress them any further at the moment. My reason being is because I'm not allowed to get DK skin. So I'm very mad with her because she is not in the shop where I can just buy her skin directly. She's in the battle pass, which I'm not allowed to get because we are on the free to play journey and we cannot break that vow. It's not going to happen. We're not going to give up. I'll buy it on the other account, which I already did. I just haven't unlocked it yet. <laughs> so when we do, we'll bask in its glory on the other account off camera. And maybe we'll do some videos and stuff on that account as well. But my next thing that I'm thinking about doing is uh, most likely I'm going to be building up the corn bloom. I feel like she gave so much value to my other account in the long run. And being a five star and not a six star, she doesn't cost as much. But the value that she brings is that much of a six star. Unfortunately, we did not get any of her uh, portraits yet. So we are still stuck with her first one. I would love to get to level two. Level two is the one that you know you wanna go for on Bicorn Bloom. It just gives her the biggest boost of power. And then after that, it's just percentages on her ult. Um, this one right here, but well, we can't click on it from here. But anyways, it's this one right here. And we're not really worried about using her as the main damage dealer anyways. Um, specifically, I like to use this debuff. This debuff is huge whenever it comes to uh, being able to utilize that. She'll help out a lot, um, and she will go well with, um, who will she go well with? Who am I looking for? Who am I looking for? Do, 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 do. Here we go. Jessica. She'll go good with Jessica once we decide to start uh, building her up as well. So it will allow some sort of synergy with Jessica if we decide to go that route. Even if we don't have Kanjira, it will just allow us to use her without her being completely useless, without any of her, you know, team team members and stuff around her. Uh, so that's the plan as of them. 
But before we start doing that, I am definitely going to put in some resources and everything to make sure that we get our resonance up on everyone. We have 37 at 10, we have him at 8, we have her at 5, and we have her at 5. These resonance right here, they don't cost too much once we get into the later one. It's just sharp dotney, which obviously we can get from our wilderness on a daily basis. And once we get through the shop on the event, we'll start racking up the dust and sharp dotney at the near end of the event, which will give us more than enough to knock those out. All right. Oh, what's up, X? Oh, you're just going to stand there? <laughs> Who's maxed out? Oh, balloon party's maxed out. Let's get her out of here. You already took up your spot, girl. You got all the points you needed. Goodbye. Who we want to Jessica, of course. Walk over there and tell Druvis that you're the main plant DPS. Tell her what's up. She's over here just big chilling, but she don't know who you are. Let her know. Nah, I'm playing. <laughs> Anyways, yeah, so my goal right now is using the resources that I have to get as many soils as I can. Uh, I will knock out the rest of these tonight. I did part one uh, and we haven't done part two yet. These are pretty easy. They're just little mazes and paths and stuff you have to go through, little puzzles. So we'll definitely knock all of these out. Uh, also, whenever you go into the uh, game news, make sure you do all of these every single day. Right now we're on day three. Um, so all we have to do is whatever it tells us to do. This one is doing the uh, Pussier uh, one time and it unlocks that for us and we can get that knocked out. Good little resources you get from here. The rewards are pretty nice. As you can see, you get some silver does sharp dot knee get some clear drops and stuff as well and then as for that make sure in the main event uh you have this right here that gives you daily little things that you can go in and knock them out like this one right here we can go to this and it allows us to pass the torch to some characters put you some characters in there it'll have a duration so that way you can knock those out as well just nice little resources that we get from it uh is there another one available for us to do i think i saw another one there we go I want to glow in and go ahead and put them in there as well to get the next four going. I don't know if putting different characters makes a difference. Oh, I'd never read that right there. My bad. So yeah, there is characters that make a difference on it. I just put four of them in there. I didn't even re read this at all, uh, but there you go. You can knock that out a little bit quicker. It makes it easier. But that's going to wrap it up for this video. Uh, pretty much just like a little account over uh, view for the day. We're trying to knock out the rest of the stuff in the Uluru games. Any of the side missions and stuff like that is our main concern. And accumulating as much of the resources as possible to start buying out the shop. If you guys haven't already, please hit that subscribe button. We do daily reverse 1999 content for the free to play journey. If you're new here and you're a free to play player, there is tons of videos that I have backlogged already. You can go back and check them. Maybe they'll help you out like on a specific day that you're on or a specific thing that you're trying to accomplish. I have a lot of stuff. It's all labeled and everything. So feel free to go back and check those out. I hope you guys the best of luck. If you are summoning for Spath, I hope they go well. If you're summoning for Jiu, Hold those diamond hands, baby, and do not spend those little bunnies. Anyways, guys, I'll see you all in the next video.